Any Iranian attack on the United States, in any form, will be answered with a thousand times larger attacks on Iran, President Donald Trump said in response to reports that the Islamic Republic was planning to assassinate the U.S. ambassador to South Africa. According to media reports, Iran may be plotting an assassination attempt or another attack on the United States to avenge the assassination of terrorist leader Soleimani, the president wrote on Twitter. According to Donald Trump, the U.S. decision to assassinate Qasem Soleimani was made because of his plot to kill American troops and the death and suffering he had caused for many years. The U.S. government has said it is plotting to assassinate U.S. Ambassador to South Africa Lana Marks, citing intelligence reports, the U.S. Daily Politico reported Monday. According to Politico, the move was designed to avenge the assassination of Qasem Soleimani, and as an American official told Politico, the embassy of the Islamic Republic in Pretoria is also involved in the plot. U.S. officials have told Politico that they have been aware of the Islamic Republic of Iran threatening Lana Marks, the U.S. ambassador to South Africa, since last spring. The South African Homeland Security Agency also responded to the report, with spokesman Mawa Scott saying, We are working with all relevant partners, at home and abroad, to ensure the safety of the U.S. ambassador. He added that the nature of the charge and the threat posed by it were such that the South African Internal Security Agency could not provide further details at this time. Meanwhile, Saeed Kadabzadeh, spokesman for the Islamic Republic's foreign ministry, dismissed Politico's report as anti-Iranian accusations and lies. He said, however, that the Islamic Republic neither forgives nor forgets the killing of Qasem Soleimani and will pursue the case internationally at all levels. U.S. Secretary of State Mike Pompeo also warned Islamic Republic officials that Washington was taking Iran's terrorist actions around the world seriously. We make it very clear to the Islamic Republic of Iran that this kind of activity, attacking any American anywhere and anytime, be it a diplomat, an ambassador, or one of our staff, is completely unacceptable, Pompeo told Fox News. He added that the Islamic Republic has carried out assassinations all over the world and in Europe. Ayatollah Ali Khomeini, the supreme leader of the Islamic Republic of Iran, said after the killings of Qasem Soleimani, commander of the Quds Force of the Revolutionary Guards, and Abu Mehdi Mohandas, commander of the Hezbollah book group, that U.S. drones had been attacked. The Revolutionary Guards then launched a missile attack on a U.S. military base in Iraq, which did not cause serious casualties due to U.S. prior knowledge and preparedness, but in the morning of that missile strike, two missiles also fired at a Ukrainian airliner, which killed all 176 occupants. Ali Khomeini, in a meeting with Iraqi Prime Minister Mustafa al qadhami on Tuesday, July 22, reiterated the killing of Qasem Soleimani and Abu Mahdi Mohandas, saying that the Islamic Republic will never forget this issue and will definitely strike back at the Americans. The U.S. government has previously warned that any retaliatory action by Iran would provoke a strong military response.